me. Help me. To be be you little moldy mushroom. Hi home doggies, hey home slices, what it is, what's up? Today, I am going to be creating the most epic camper van gaming setup that you'll ever see in the United Kingdom. We are going to create some magic. I'm going to show you the VR now and show you what it looks like now. It's pretty pretty spicy but it's going to be even spicier when it is the vr of our dreams and we can game in it with a monitor with lights with all my consoles with loads of food this is going to be amazing if you haven't checked out my gaming for video please make sure you go and check that out but now we have things to do let's go Now, before we get on to the making of the most epic camper van setup gaming epic gamer girl thing ever, I want to address something with you guys. So the title of this video states something about me buying a camper van. Something about me owning a camper van. Something that implies that the camper van is mine. Well, first of all, I want to say, <laughs> got him. It's not mine at all. But it is mine, it's mine for the week. Therefore, whatever the title says, this camper van is mine. And why do I have this camper van in this big, this big ass VR? You might ask, well, that's because I manifested it. I put it on Twitter that I, I want a camper van and now it's on my drive. And the reason this is, is because I am trying it out to see if I want to buy one in the future. I live in the countryside, if you didn't know, and here are we, where there's just a lot of trees. There's a hell of a lot of trees, a lot of cows, a lot of grass, and I am in love with the world. I want to travel, and not always on a plane, I want to live in a camper van at some point in my life, even if it's a few months out of the year that I travel. That's what I want to do. So. You guys, if you really thought I was rich enough to afford a 50,000 pound camper van, thank you. But unfortunately, I'm not. And it's not mine, nor will it will be, until I'm stinking rich and I've conquered the world and I become president. Then it will be mine. Anyway, I'm gonna drink this, this, and then I'm going to introduce you to Sheila. You are not ready. Chin chin. Chin chin. I love you. Excuse. Oh, oh, oh. Oh no. You want some attention. Sheila, open, open those doors. Open these up. Super dark in here. Let that be light. Hello, MTV. Hello, everybody. Welcome to my crib. I've got a lot of planning to do. So, I did this before 
when I was doing a gaming setup. There's not much I have to do with this because it's already like a big ass fort anyway. People, go away, go away, go away. Okay, <laughs> they're gone. Right, um, but I'm just gonna transform this into a seriously cool gaming setup for the day. However, we do need to make a list of things that we need. I mean, where's my phone? It's not in my bag. Hold on. I'm back. I would like to make non-alcoholic cocktails because I don't really drink much and oh, kind of like the most excitable person without it anyway. Non-alcoholic porn star martini. I love me a good porn star. Okay. We need passion fruit, orange and ice. Soda. Is that lemonade? Now, when I'm thinking about my favorite snacks when gaming, obviously has to be Doritos. Nuts. These nuts. These nuts. Cupcakes. Fuck, Fuck the diet. We're having cupcakes. Um, what else do I like to eat? Grapes and cheeses and crackers. That's it, we've done. And also, I don't normally eat meat this much, but I'm gonna have to go with shalami. That is a spread. This is, is this, this here, this here right now is an executive camper van gaming experience. Okay. Now, I take it that you guys want to see where the magic happens. Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? Oh, hi. Oh. People keep looking at me. Right, I'm gonna give you a quick tour, then we're gonna head out and get the food because I'm hungry. I'm gonna just take you around with me. Here is where you do the driving. There is a lot of space. Don't look at my feet. And then you've got the settee here. So here is where the seating area is. I'm not sure if I'm gonna bring the gaming here or over there um, near the kitchen in the bedroom. But this is the seating area. And as you can see up there, that's where the drivers are. Your cupboards are here. This is where I'm gonna fit the snacks, but I'm not quite sure, not quite sure if I can fit in here, to be honest, but I'll try. Look at this small TV. World domination. Potato, potato. Oh, that's better. And of course, this is where the magic happens. This is where I'm going to do the gaming and then I'm going to put the snacks on the table. I'm going to put the monitor right here and a few of the Beveroonies in there. And I have something awesome to show you guys, but this could be a massive safety hazard. But look, it's a shield. Or it's an umbrella. Or Why did you do that? It's a baton. Whatever you decide this to be, this is also included in your motorhome. This right here <laughs> is luxury within itself. I'm super excited and um, I'm not showing you the best of it yet. No, 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 no. The fridge, an empty fridge, and this, this isn't a good sign. Nope. Also, the bathroom, hi. The toilet, this here is where you pee or poo. You can use the toilet and shower. This is revolutionary. Not only that, you can poo, pee, shower, Nasty. and drink. <laughs> mom is here. Hi, mom. Hello. Where are you going? In your house. Do you want to come in my caravan and play games with me? No, I'm going to. See You're going the dogs. to? Okay. <laughs> that is how I'm treated by my own mother. Anyway, time to go and get the snacks and time to set this up. We're gonna do some gaming. <laughs> the journey begins. We are heading to the shop to get the goods. I'm so hungry as well. Totally hungry and stuff, so we need to go to the shops and 
stuck my fucking cheeks, bro. You have reached your destination. We made it. Let's go! Go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Home time. We gotta go home. As I was explaining before, I want this to be the most epic gaming setup of ever. So I'm literally gonna bring the monitor and everything. I'm gonna place it all on this bed, take it into the caravan, then we can get going. Lights. Control. Z monitor. <laughs> Look how messy it is. There is more stuff than I thought that I'll have to take downstairs. This is ridiculous. Okay, that is indeed everything. Now, I'm gonna go to the camper and set all of this up and you guys are gonna wait there. Can I trust you to stay here without going through my drawers? I don't think so. You're gonna have to leave. Goodbye. Okay, so what I have truly decided on is making this part of the camper the gaming part it's where i'm gonna put all the lights i'm gonna put the uh, electricals over here on the side and we're gonna be perfectly set for the most epic gaming night ever first of all, first of all lights. lights we need some light so for the monitor i am thinking we are going to put that over here it's the most perfect position for gaming because who doesn't want to game in the utmost comfort i know i do these chairs they're good but they're not as comfy as the boudoir and i'm also going to put the playstation over here now for the lights um i like a little bit of ambiance on the hook over the what's that <gasps> bye yeah i like that <laughs> for the lights these belong in the boudoir and luckily we have a perfect amount of plugs because i don't know if you can see this over here we've got a plug socket so we are going to put that over there and plug this if you have a gaming setup and you don't have some seriously cheap lights that you can just put anywhere at any time what are you doing i'm thinking up here would look cool. Put it all the way around if it will stick. That will do. And then we have the, the laptop. I'm gonna put this over there because I'm trying to um, skill up, rank up on Fortnite because I'm not very good at it. Um, I've just got my gaming PC and I want to get better. So I'm gonna put this over there so I can kind of watch people play Fortnite whilst I play Fortnite. Inception. You know what I'm saying. And just like that, we have a home cinema. Okay, so I have just finished the majority of this camper van setup. The world is absolutely beautiful. I just wanna put I just wanna put that out there because sometimes I don't appreciate it. So now the main setup is done, everything looks sick. This is ultimate comfort. I'm so excited. We've got to get sacked, then we can have a night of gaming in the camper van this here is life this one day will be mine and i'm my, my words give me till next year guys i'm manifesting this because i'm gonna i'm why am i getting emotional it's a material object but it's just the freedom of being able to just go anywhere you want with your complete setup feeling comfortable i just like the feeling of being free hence why whilst i'm always wearing those shoes and socks even when i'm outside it's just the, the feeling of freedom Freedom! Cake. Crackers. We got some corn chips in this. Salami. Hummus. Olives. Cheese. And that's it. It's sad that I've made a whole feast to go and eat it in a mojo and play games. Or is it the coolest thing ever? Who knows? This is 
absolutely perfect. This is crazy. I've got my PlayStation set up, all is working perfectly. We've got Wi-Fi, really good Wi-Fi, so we can play Fortnite and play The Last of Us. We've got everything set up over there for snacks. We've got our lighting system. We have got our little TV if we want to watch um, some gameplay or some films. This is absolutely <sighs> perfect. It is perfect. I thought I didn't have enough plugs, but I've attached my phone to the playstation my playstation is set up set up right here so and again the laptop this is the view from here it's pretty much perfect is this not perfect this entire setup is an absolute <laughs> dream then um you just saw it really i don't really need to show you we've got snack we've got snacks in the fridge and that's that absolute most perfect location i'm ready to spend some time gaming going out for a nice walk this is how you social distance this is how you thoroughly enjoy lockdown it's just a shame that this is going to not be mine after a few days i'm so sad about it but did you hear that let's have the coolest gaming night ever because i I'm so happy about this, this is incredible. Ever from this really expensive camper van, and yes, I'm flexing because I cannot afford this. <laughs> I cannot <laughs> afford this. So I actually ended up moving the uh, monitor so I can play laying back like this. So I so I can then play laying back like. Anyway, you guys can hang out for a bit, but I'm gonna go play, chill, spend the weekend here, right here, doing nothing but gaming and a tinsy bit of editing. I've been chilling, gaming, watching YouTube videos for about two hours now. Um, I feel so relaxed here. Um, in the middle of nowhere. It's really nice. This is something that I could get used to. I don't have much, I don't have many things anyway. And I could definitely stream from here. It'd be so sick. What I'm saying is, maybe camper life is Leave some comments in the description. Let me know if you enjoy this type of video because I love to vlog. And I'm not sure if you guys enjoy my vlogs. And if you don't, then I'm going to be very disappointed. So maybe lie to me because you don't want to upset me. Anyway, we can't leave without the cyber hugs. Mmm. Mm. Lovely.